them for money. If you're asking them for money, they want to make sure, are we giving our money to a nut? Is this person really knows what they're doing? How would they know that? Based on your projection. If you have, for example, in the very first year, you're saying, I'm going to make $100,000 on the first year, second year, a million, whatever, then they know that like this, this person is not okay and we cannot be dealing with that person. But if you're making reasonable things, even based on what you have projected, you have to say, why do you think you're going to make this kind of money? Do you have current customers right now? What is it that makes you think that you're going to make this money? And then have you factored in your expenses? Do you think, okay, you have, you're going to generate maybe 100000 but when you're looking at your expenses, did you factor in the fact that we're giving you a loan? Did you count how you're going to pay us our money, including our interest? Is that reflecting in your income statement and balance sheet and everything that there is there? And when they look at your balance sheet, they're assessing this hypothetical business that you're trying to start. What is the net worth of this business? And what is in it for me if you don't pay me what do I have to take away from you? Collateral. So all these kind of things, and we'll get more in depth. I know like some people are following with me and some are not, and we will work with you. And we'll make sure that everything that we're saying, like even in our marketing plan, if we're saying, oh, we're gonna advertise a lot or whatever, all that stuff that we're writing also have to reflect in the paperwork in terms of numbers. So second, sorry, the other step here, step seven, with operation and financial section, we need to know how much does it cost for you to open your doors today? You have to have a number in your head that every time that I'm opening this store or I'm running this business, I need to make at least this amount of money. That's called a break even. That means your revenues and expenses will be zero. You're not making any money, but what would that number be like? You need to know that for your business so that you can see is it really realistic for me if I need to make $500 a day to break even before I see any profit? Is it really reasonable or what else can I do different so I can either reduce that number or I can increase that revenue so that I have my profit? 